good evening traders I'm just having uh, firing off a couple of quick trades before I retire for the evening it's um, 8 49 p.m. down under here in Australia and I've just had a, uh, a trade fire off on the FESX the euro stock x50 and looking for another trade setup you learn all of these setups in my course if you'd like further information please drop me an email and I'll send you an information pack about my fast track program so just uh, why we're waiting here I'm actually waiting for a t2 signal so a t2 the greatest challenge I have at the moment with this trade which is over here on the right is that um, you can see here where I shorted for a t10 here 10 contracts with six ticks you can see my trade station entry there my exit just here and now I'm waiting for a trade entry right here but my challenge is we're right on a pivot now notice this support we've had here support or really a bit of resistance punch through come down gone up we had some divergence here I didn't take the divergence trade uh, I jumped in let me just adjust this a little bit I jumped in uh, here as a t10 just some comments I was I put down here we had uh, if we go back to the opening of the euro stock x50 we had a perfect t2 uh, had some divergence and my comment here was for a training session I'm doing later on what can go wrong with counter trend trading even though you had a, um, a pivot bounce and divergence it only went down a couple of ticks and then went on its merry way that can be one of the challenges and that's why you must go for a minimum of two to one uh, we had then uh, another beautiful t2 we had then a t10 but right on the pivot so there's issues with those but then we had a beautiful uh, t1 uh, now ignore the red candle because you didn't get into this green candle here with the trend so if you look overall you've had uh, one two you've had uh, uh, winner winner uh, if you had have taken that one that would have been a loss a winner and another very nice winner and of course uh, we've just had our very nice t10 that turned into by the way into uh, a t1 now this is really a, a when you get a lower high and that is what we've got here it's a little hard for you to see but there's actually a paint bar there's a candle formation that we have there that we call a super scalper so I managed to get in just because of pattern recognition I got in on the crossover now the other point I was going to point here is note how the short-term stochastic did not cut through the long term now see this pattern here see how my long terms come down the short term's gone up and it's rolled up and over before it cut through see over here where we've cut through we've cut through now notice this pattern here my long-term stochastic is basically oversold my short term has come up and rolled over and that is what initiated the trade for me one is I could see the formation we had a little failed t1 signal here and then it fell away so I'll just put this on hold and see if I get I'm going to give another 10 minutes uh, if not I'm going to call it a night so uh, my daily goal is $200 a day per contract I'm actually increasing that I'm, I'm setting up a program and calling it actually t400 the target 400 which all of my students will get involved in and it's to increase our overall targets from 200 to 400 and on, another, on another video I'll be explaining how we'll be doing that um, just while I'm here we had a, a very nice divergence trade there notice you got a little double top higher high uh, I wasn't in the room at the time in my office at the time so I missed that one but I had this one so this is a nice start for the day this is what I'd call my day starts tomorrow technically <laughs> so it's very very early uh, Monday morning in the United States but of course the euro stock x50 is the European market so what I've noticed here is we've got fairly low volume we've had a banking holiday in Japan today uh, for the day so far I'm just opening up this if the Nasdaq's only turned over 8,000 contracts fairly slow today 
and the ES the e minis 42,000 of course we are in the aftermarket uh, after hours market it is very very quiet so I'm hoping we'll get a turnover I'm going to roll over here five minutes if it hasn't been five minutes uh, I'll pull the video and still post it just for some information for those interested in the euro stock x50 you can see we gapped up slightly when the market opened it rallied up pull back t2 entry t2 and getting back to this comment I made here what can go wrong with counter trend trading you you make a very very nice income sticking with the trend you know if you want a real no stress trading life don't take counter trend trades t10s are usually very very good this one fail but you get a good two to one return on, on t10s they're normally a, a, a great trade and they're an 85 percent every day of a week but if you want to keep it safe stay with the trend and if you look at the here just since the market opened in really what's that five o'clock in four hours you've won two you had four beautiful with trend trades um, uh, and you would have packed your bags up uh, you're up over three hundred dollars per contract on those so I'll put this on hold so uh, you don't have to listen to me ramble still waiting uh, one thing that we do have here and for traders um, those of you that have watched my uh, trading pivots videos that was a, a pivot bounce counter trend this was a with trend uh, uh, pivot and of course you've got one over here as well you've got a, an entry right there see this um, uh, this bounce on the pivot here so you would have been up one two three four one two yes four ticks at the moment if you had been taking pivot bounces now for my students that want to just match my charts I'm trading an 89 tick chart here so this is an 89 tick and of course uh, let, of what I've got up here also the, the uh, black lines here the channel is a standard error bands so if I just disable those for a moment I'm just going to put up there uh, let's see here I've now got on there my standard EMA channels just patiently waiting it's always nice to retire for viewing with a, uh, a very nice start to your trading day another uh, four or five tick winner here would be very very nice you see this uh, quite often that the, the euro stock x50 is a slower moving market mind you you get some fantastic volume now so far today uh, it's turned over 246,000 contracts and so it's 10 euros per point when I say tick or point it's the same thing because with the euro stock is 50 there um, uh, it's it moves in a full point or a full tick it's the same value 10 euros now if we now look at this trade this is why even if it rolls over now I will not be taking a trade here notice my long-term stochastic down the bottom here it's now broken up past the 20 zone notice my yellow line my 34 my 89 they're all basically horizontal now going sideways and if I look back at this pivot resistance become support become support it may very well bounce come down here and bounce up again it's, it might be good for a couple of ticks so the um, moving average is very close and horizontal to the pivots it's a real danger zone it can be a real chop zone so traders I've jumped in and unfortunately the markets running away I haven't been filled on all of my contracts here I'm just going to do a quick scalp on 20 for four ticks and you'll notice here that um, I've now got a t1 
so my exit is going to be right at this pivot so we can see here that uh, I actually only had six of my contracts filled and two ticks to go so we can see here that we've now had another lower high so I had a lower high here lower high here but what we're going to be very aware of here it can bounce off the pivot and also my long-term stochastic is going up now because not all of my contracts have been filled what I will do once I hit the fill on six of these contracts get filled down here I will then cancel the rest and that will deliver in a moment one more tick to go and I'm out for three hundred and twenty five dollars on six contracts and sorry about the little audio glitch I was chatting away before and um, but I put the uh, put it on mute so sorry if you didn't miss some of the instructions I was giving earlier now the safer way for newer members or students is to actually wait until you get this rollover of the zero lag this is one of our very very mechanical trades and you can see why you can see here we've gone up the danger here was was our long-term stochastic I've gone along on the basis also that with this trade that uh, a lot of the other markets are rolling over as well come on one more tick that's all I need and uh, that's half of my tomorrow's budget done <laughs> for, uh, for trading I've got a busy day lined up anyway so uh, come on hurry up sometimes as I say it's like waiting for oil paint to dry okay so we're just waiting waiting for it to pop down well I did get my second trading before I retired for the evening anyway I just wanted to deliver one I, I never like to leave a trade on traders um, likewise one of the things to do whenever I go out or whenever you go out leave your office for, for the day or whatever always check your trading platform make sure that you've closed down any positions um, mind you your trading plan may be uh, you may be holding positions for a day and whatever it's just a str just a rule I have as a day trader I like to be there when my trades are on but I suppose you could really say I'm more of a scalper here we go all right so we're hitting my target this is five ticks or five points my risk was uh, was only uh, three in this particular case and now you'll hear me talk about in my videos front running and one of the reasons why we want to front run these trades is right on this pivot now because we've tested it a number of times we may be ready to punch through anyway that was two winning trades in a row uh, if you've got any questions please uh, drop me an email traders if you haven't already subscribed to my channel please do or if you'd like more information about my fast track program if you're looking at day trading for a career, a career this is the best $197 you'll ever spend it's now getting close to 15 hours of total recorded training where I teach you my 12 best strategies and of course give you comprehensive email support so I'll sign off Thank you, traders.